My name is Lucas Amon. It's great to see so many familiar faces here in the audience. Today, I would like to give you a brief insight of Decadu's digital health platform, which is used by some of the largest life and health insurances worldwide. Today, we have real digital insurance projects running in New Zealand, in Switzerland, in Germany, in Holland, in the United States. And I would like to give you a, a brief overview of what we do. In a nutshell, Decadu is a platform company, which is a big difference to all the app companies um, out there, which means that our B2B clients, which are life and health insurances and large corporates for corporate health initiatives, can use the Decadu solution in a completely white label. That means they get their own apps, they get their own content, they get their own uh, uh, domain name, uh, and Decadu stays in the background. Maybe it's powered by Decadu. They can use the, the the, uh, the platform like this, or they can decide to do their own digital offering and can simply connect to our backend via our RESTful API and build their own digital uh, solutions and apps on top of what we do today. So what is the problem of life and health insurance today? Number one, you don't have a good relationship with the client. Number two, you don't have a real digital connection with the client yet. And number three, you do not play a relevant part in your client's life yet. We believe that we can solve these problems through the different modules that we have on the platform, and you decide then what kind of modules you, might, you would like to push out to your clients and how. It could be private clients, it could be your corporate clients. Um, I'll show you how this is done. So the first step um, of what you would like to do to create value for your client to, um, to start a relationship with your client is that you have to start as life and health insurance to measure and analyze health holistically. Um, the big problem today in this big health and well-being industry is that we and all your insurance clients have access to a huge amount of, of health data through all these wearables, devices, the step counters and so forth. And if you're not a doctor or a sports scientist, you simply do not know what this data mean for you because nobody is analyzing this data today. What happens then is that the users of such devices, after a couple of days, they disappear in the, in the, in the drawer and is never used again, and they lose interest because there is no output and it's not relevant. This is why we at Decadu, we said we have to find a way to break down health into one number. This is the health score that you see here. This is my profile. Um, I'm at 738 out of 1,000. At one, I'm dead. At 1,000, I'm Superman. The health score is based on the elements lifestyle, body, and mind. So we have to look at health holistically and not only look at the activities that we do. Um, what I'm showing you here is pictures. Um, otherwise, uh, and my, my roaming is not, not big enough. This is why um, you have the wrong timing on top. So lifestyle, body, and mind. Um, the health score today is based on more than 200 million man years of clinical data which sits below this and we can start through the health store to make people understand where they stand in their health so we can start a conversation you can see it tells me where i am with my health score compared to the other decade users today i get a feedback of why am i improving in my health or why am i'm getting um, of, of my, why my health is decreasing. So you can start the conversa conversation and for the first time I get output and this is meaningful for me because I start to understand my health better. It shows me my lifestyle balance. At the moment it tells me that I'm not sleeping enough and the coaching will then tell me that, that I should change my eating, eating behavior for example. I can see my activities, my stress level and my nutrition and based on my individual profile um, the coach will um, or guide me where I should need to go. So this is the first element of what you need to do in order to start to play a relevant uh, role in your client's life is the health score. And the health score then allows us to produce analytics uh, such as segmenting health scores by age or gender or geographic locations or cities. It also allows us to produce statistical probabilities of major diseases such as cancer, cardiovascular disease, um, diabetes, and so forth, which is very interesting for your um, uh, underwriting models in life and health insurances. So we talked about analyzing and looking at health. The health score is, a, is one USP that we have today and is very interesting for insurances for various reasons. 
The second part is the engagement. Today, everybody is talking about engagement, but nobody knows how, how to do it. So we have several engagement modules that we have today on the platform to get your insurance clients involved, to give them something which is relevant for them, which is easy for them to understand, and is fun. If your system is not fun, nobody will use it, and we will simply throw it away. So I'm showing you, this is one element, this is the coaching. The coach tells me when I did something well, he um, tells me what, uh, he asks me questions about my family history of illness, he asks me questions about my nutrition habits, about my exercise, and based on, on my answers, he will send me different questions. So the system learns, and the idea is that over time, your insurance clients will get personalized coaching over time, and you start to have this relationship with the client that you, that you so badly need because um, it suddenly becomes relevant. The coach also suggests, depending on my profile, different um, exercise programs that I can follow if I want to. So for example, he shows me, do you want to get moving with running? I say, yes, this is interesting for me. I even get 100 points you see below if I complete this program. So the coach takes me, takes me by the hand and he guides me through the program. If I finish this after three weeks, I get points which I then can also redeem in an online shop, for example. Um, the nutrition coach, for example, based on my nutrition intake that I have on my profile, he would recommend me uh, to reduce my soft drink intake, for example, or to improve my eating behavior. I can say, yeah, I'm interested in this. I, I tap on it, and I see when I complete the cut my soft drinks, uh, program, I get 500 points. It shows me my activities, my goals that are upcoming, but I can also switch off the coaching if I don't want to be coached. So this has to be personalized and the user has to decide how he or she likes to be coached or not. Then there's a tracking element. We are completely device and hardware agnostic. So we are connected with um, all the Fitbits, the Garmin's, the Polar's, the Jawbones. We give you this hub you can decide to use it if you want to, because you, we want to let your insurance clients decide what kind of devices they want to use. And we simply connect them and your, and your clients uh, connect the devices. Then obviously you can start to track, you see um, your average speed, your output, you can upload pictures, you can share it with your friends. Um, and this is the, the next element, this is the social and gamification element, where I can, if I want to, connect with my friends, I can see what kind of activities they do, if they accept my friend request, of course. And data privacy, by the way, is on the very, very important for us. We have to follow the data privacy laws in the EU and Switzerland, so this data is not shared with the insurance if the insurance client doesn't want it. So this is always his or her decision. I can join groups if I want to. Within the groups, for example, if you as an insurance would like to push this out to your corporate clients, they can have different groups in, within your um, white label offering. They can be branded the way they want and your insurance clients or your corporate clients can start to uh, build their own ecosystem. I can join nutrition quizzes, other challenges, and then the, the next step on your way to become a relevant partner for your clients is that you want to reward them. This is similar to what you know from the Vitality product. This is a reward shop that we have um, in implemented. It's a completely functional point and reward shop, which you can launch if you want to. You don't have to. This is another module that we have. We don't care. Uh, you choose how you want to use the system. So you see, so far, I have gained 38,000 points. And I simply connect. I go to the online shop, which, it, which again is white labeled for your uh, for your brand, and then I can decide. I can decide to go to camping or outdoor, fitness or sport, and you as an insurance decide what kind of products are in your shop, how this should look, how many points me as your client, um, how how many points I can gain over a certain time, because obviously you have to offset budget for this, and I can. Uh, get my snorkeling set. You see, it costs me 4,400 points. To get this, I can choose how many points I want to use for this and how much I want to pay in cash. And I got um, uh, my product. What you also get is obviously an analytics tool so that you understand whether your digital platform actually works or not. So you see how many people you have invited, how many are active, how many are active users, how many are inactive users, how many women are on the platform, how many men, what kind of activities they like to do. So these are anonymized reports, and you can then see um, what is happening. You see the, the health trends, and you can support your clients by uh, giving um, more uh, information through the coaches, so you start the relationship. Um, 
So to wrap up, I think all this, um, because I'm running out of time, all these mo modules, we believe that you can make the shift from uh, traditional insurance where you have no connection with the client besides an ever-increasing um, premium, uh, increase in premium, to a, a real-time lifestyle-based underwriting. Your return on investment comes from three, three different areas. Number one, through a platform like this, which is interesting for your client, you build trust, you get people to stay with you longer, you have more people who are attracted to, to be insured with you. Number two, you can start to cross-sell uh, because you know your client better, you have uh, um, an, an area of trust, you know when he or she gets married, when there is a baby, so you can start to sell more insurance products. And last but not least, your insurance uh, live healthier and longer because they engage in, in, a, in a, a healthy lifestyle. So three different areas of return on investment. Thank you so much for listening. Uh, please uh, visit us at our booth over there. Thank you for listening and see you later.